For 16 months now, the Cobb County School District has had no crisis alert system. And tonight, we're just learning new details about how a cyber hack rendered the system unusable. And now parents say they want both transparency and accountability from the district. Caitlin Ross has the story. Cobb County parents say they want answers about how the district is working to keep their kids safe. The parents I talked to say right now they're not getting them. No, absolutely not. Parent Heather Tully Bauer says she's not satisfied with the information the Cobb County superintendent released about school safety in the district. I want to know the school's thinking about it. I want to know that the district is taking this seriously. She co-founded the Watch the Funds group. They're asking questions about $5 million the district spent on the alert point system. With it, teachers should be able to alert police to a threat at the press of a button, but the system was cyber hacked in February of 2021. Now the superintendent admits it has not worked since then. He says that the system was unusable. Um, we didn't know that. Tolly Bauer says some teachers were not even trained and didn't have the badges that would make it work. The superintendent says they're now under contract with a new system. While we want to explain and ensure to parents that student and staff safety is our top priority. We must also ensure that our safety protocols, procedures, processes, and systems remain confidential. We asked the district how much money it spent on the new system, but they have not responded. It's supposed to work a lot like the old system, but Tully Bauer says she hopes this time there are better results. We entrust them with our children's hearts and minds, and now unfortunately their lives. And we want to know that those hardworking people have the tools that they want, that they need, and that actually work. Parents say they plan to be at every school board meeting until they get those answers. Reporting in Cobb County, Caitlin Ross, 11 Alive News.